Uh, I'm, I'm a Londoner. Do you, uh, any Londoners in? Yeah. yeah, I'm a Londoner. A very proud Londoner, too, you know, after the summer that we had, you know, hosting the Olympics. Did, did we enjoy the Olympics? Yeah. Uh, they, they were good, innit? They were surprisingly good. Uh, that's what made it even better. <laughs> No, let, let, let's be honest, but before the Olympics started, there was that, that typical British attitude towards it, innit? Because only in Great Britain could we have the Olympics, the world's greatest sporting event, and still be pissed off about it, right? <laughs> but the only nation, like, like for example, in, in Australia in 2000, when they got the Olympics, they were over the moon. They were like, yeah, we got the Olympics. And in Greece in 2004, they were like, yes, the games come home. We get the Olympics, and we're like, oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> Who's paying for this shit? <laughs> I like the Olympics, man. I think, I think what I liked the most about the Olympics was the way that it inspired young people to get involved in sport, you know, like the whole inspired generation. I thought that was lovely. Like, um, like prime example was uh, the lighting of the Olympic flame. Everyone thought it was going to be Sir Steve Redgrave or Daley Thompson. And in the end, they got seven young people to do it, which I thought was lovely. Because if you remember correctly, the last summer we had, where there was a bunch of young people running around London... <laughs> ..with a fire in their hand... <laughs> Wasn't exactly Olympic, was it? I mean, technically, some of them were going for gold. But... 